So far in this section, we have seen how to apply themes that change the look and feel of the entire diagram. Then we have seen how to select shapes and exclude them from getting theme changes. In this lesson, we will go one step further and see how to apply special formatting for one or more shapes. You will want to apply special formatting when you want to draw the viewer's attention to a special process or something of significance that is different from the rest of the diagram. In the next lesson, we will also see similarly for lines. Okay, in my diagram, I want to draw special attention to the lockout process shape. The reason is this is a special process and not a part of a normal login process. I will first scroll to the side so you can see clearly what I am going to do. Then I will select the shape. If you do a multi select of other shapes, then everything we do next will apply to them also. After selecting, I want to use the shape styles section in the home tab. As I select some of the pre-built designs here, you can see the real time preview has kicked in and I can see how it is going to look. But that's not all. There are a whole lot of other ways I can format. I will first expand the whole drop down here. And immediately you can see there are 40 plus pre-built designs that you can use. Most often you will find one of these will suit your needs. If that is not enough, you can customize this in much greater granularity also. To do that, just click on this small arrow pull down at the right end of the section here. And this opens up a new pane. Let me just zoom in a little bit. Using this pane, you can front change the colors, gradients and so on and so forth. There is a small pentagon icon on the top here. Actually, it is the effects tab. And this again opens up a whole lot of visual formatting options for you. You can add shadows, reflections, glows and then you can even transform the 2D shape into a 3D shape also like this. I will leave it as an exercise for you to explore these options. The nice aspect of this is that Visio provides you with the real time feedback on how your shape is going to look in the diagram. Finally, a note of caution. It is very easy to get carried away with the hundreds of visual formatting tools provided by Visio. But one should not sacrifice style over substance. If the formatting reduces the readability of the diagram, then it is not solving its purpose. So use these tools, but use it in moderation.